Hi and welcome to Little Bits Honeybee. He's got a little swarm, probably a mating swarm in the yard. You see him up there? I'm going to stand over by this little apple tree and I'm going to call these girls in. I just seen the, the queen land on the limb. I'll get back and show you that here in a minute. This, let me get this right here and show you what I'm using. It was a fast deal. They was uh, swarming there. I just got a, high, a big heavy crowbar, L bar. I've got a wire attached to it. Just stand by a small bush and beat it. When, in, when a swarm's in the air, Eight out of ten times, they'll come right and land in that tree. Sometimes it happens pretty quick. Other times it takes four or five minutes, but I have no idea. An old-timer showed me that years and years ago, and it works. Works. Work, I forget what it's called, but it looked like it was just a small mating swarm. Let me see if I can get up here and show you where it, where it landed. Now, she could just let them go and they could find her box maybe, but ain't no big deal. I'll just get a, get a box and put them in it. Uh, I'll pause this for a minute and I'll get a box ready and we'll come back and get the, these girls down. Well, I played around too long and they're back in there again. I see if we can call them back down. I don't know if we can or not. Never tried that. And the reason I want to uh, catch this, oh, get a swarm in the yard. It gets the whole yard messed up, and you have other boxes swarm out. I don't know. I never called them in twice. We'll see what happens here. They're hanging right around here. We'll see. This usually works so good that I, I keep this set up right in front of the garage so I can get up there and get to it pretty quick. Because once they've settled in a tree, you can't get them, to usually get them to budge. Enough, I seen the front queen come in. And I really don't care if we catch it or not. It's just a matter I want them out of the yard. Like I say, call it swarming causes swarming, even if it's a mating swarm. First, she go down and land on her box. Less work for me. She's still in there. I guess I should have sprayed them down with sugar water before I went and got the ladder and stuff. Yeah, you know, 
end up here and try to take a box over. Okay, that worked. I had some queen cages where I was releasing queens a while ago. And they come up here and evidently she it drawed the bees in and they're gonna they're gonna light right here on these queen cages. I don't have to get a ladder that way. We just gotta find her. I had a cage in my pocket. I don't even know what I've done with it. There it is. Got it right here. <laughs> I just laid them queen cages down there a little while ago. They should suck the queen right down if she's not already down here. I don't want them really close to that hive. They're gonna, well, we'll start trying to go in and take it over and we end up getting two queens killed. Let's move it up here out of the way. I know this hive is queen right. We're gonna move this lid over here. They'll call the swarm down. Make sure the queen is not on here on the side of the box. I don't see her nowhere. Kind of get them away from this hive. Now well, I get it up here out of the way from that hive. May take a little bit to get them drawn over here. I'm trying to get the camera where the light shining better. See, I don't know. I don't. I think they swarmed on that cage, and I think that the queen ain't in with that bunch. I don't want her to take this hive over at all. Be nice to find the queen here in this pile, get her pinned up. I'm not seeing her yet. Smell them queen pheromones. Queen man went back to the box. I don't see too many bees in the air now. These have got stragglers here that just got sucked off from uh, the swarm because of the smell of the cages. I think. There's 
trying to do what I didn't want them to do, and that, that's land on and try to take another hive over. I think I'll just pin this other hive up for a while. See if we can get something. They'll back up. That's too big. Well, shoot. what they get for leaving queen cages laying around. But I just was doing that. That's what I was doing when I seen them swarming. And she found her way back to her hive and lost these bees. We'll just give this weak hive a little more Brood and give them a queen. Hmm. The weird circumstance. Put a queen pheromone strip in, I'll move these cages and see if I can See if we can draw some in this box. Won't be able to tell if we get the queen or not, but it really doesn't matter. Get these cages up here, we're off here where they don't belong anyway. Main thing I want is to swarm out of the yard. We'll get that done one way or the other. This wasn't exactly what I'd planned on videoing, but things don't always turn out the way you want it to. You seen them land in the tree one time, and evidently that wasn't where they were wanting to go. But it did pull them down. She's evidently got back in her box. I'm not seeing 
too many bees flying around right now. They're starting to fan. I'll leave this other hive pinned up for just a little bit. I'll try to get a close up of them fanning. There may not may be the queen or it may be just the pheromone strip. I'll try to get a real close up of these down here if I can. You can see them on the edge of the box with their butts in there. Fanning. Well, like I say, the queen may have landed in there, or they could be doing that on the uh, cause of the queen pheromone. Either way, I, the queen, I think, I won't move this back away from this box a little bit. This is a box the queen didn't return, and I uh, had it marked to add bees. And give them a queen. Well, we're adding a few bees. We'll pause this for a little bit. Well, I got accomplished what I wanted to get accomplished. That was to get the swarm out of there so I didn't get the whole yard riled up. Try to take over another hive. I doubt that the queen was in there because I think the swarm went on down and probably got in their box. These was the stragglers it got. But this had about a half a frame of bees in it. This collected enough bees that it'll... Uh, uh, I'll be able to put a, a virgin queen in there and she'll have her chance to find out, see if she can find her box. If, but if you like the videos, you know, hit the subscribe button, the bell next to it, and you get notified when we make more videos. The part that I wanted to see is, is calling them down with that, that tool. And I just didn't squirt them down with sugar water before I left anywhere else. They, 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 it was a mating swarm. It wasn't a, coming out of a box. So hopefully she got back, found her hive, and she's all right. These girls here have got enough bees to try to make them a queen. Thanks for watching.